What's up penguins? My name is Mara. I'm a variety streamer here on YouTube and today we are starting a brand new series on my channel. I'm so excited you guys. We are going to be playing modded Stardew Valley. Now I've played the game since launch but I've never tried it with mods before so this is definitely a new new one for me. I can't wait to see uh, what kind of mods we are going to be trying out. I don't even know. I don't even know what the mods in, um, include you guys. I want to keep myself in the dark until I actually get to play the game. So I'm really pumped about this. And also want to mention that if you enjoy Stardew Valley casual games like Animal Crossing and games like that, make sure to hit that sub button. We actually stream every week here on YouTube. So make sure to sub, come join us, say hi in the chat while we are live as well. And if you are new, completely new to my channel, make sure to say hi in the comments below and welcome. Hope you guys are excited. I'm, I'm really excited. So let's just go ahead and start a new save. All right, here we go. I'm going to take a moment to customize my character and I'll be right with you guys. We're going to be going with the farm type that comes with the mod. Stardew Valley expanded again. Immersive Farm 2 Remastered. A huge plot of land with gated progression features stillable grass and secrets to discover. I'm excited. And of course, we're not going to be skipping the intro. I have this feeling that there might be some new stuff uh, coming with the intro as well. So I'm ready to go. Everything looks okay. Double checking. Yeah, we're good. Let's go you guys. I'm so excited. Oh. Hitting the fields as it always does. And for my very special granddaughter. I want you to have the sealed envelope. Oh, Grandpa, why? No, no, don't open yet. Have patience. Oh, I really should do a um, crab voice. I'm, I'm really bad with those. Now, listen close. There will come a day when you feel crushed by the burden of modern life. And your bright spirit will fade before a growing emptiness. When that happens, my dear, you'll be ready for this gift. Oh, Sansa. Did I say Sansa? <laughs> I said Sansa. Grandpa, let Grandpa rest. Oh my gosh, I just ruined the moment. Fantastic. Years later. We are back in the good old Joja. Join us. Thrive. Work. Work. No rest. Here we go with the cubicles. Our terminated neighbor. This cowboy right there. And there's us. Looking oh so happy. Life's better with Joja. It's not. Spoilers, it's not. Alright, here we go. So far, it's a uh, vanilla intro. Timur, if you're reading this, you must be in dire need of change. The same thing happened to me long ago. I had lost sight of what mattered most in life, real connections with other people and nature. So I dropped everything and moved to the place I truly belong. I became close the deed to that place. My pride and joy, Penguin Farm, is located in Stardew Valley on the southern coast. It's a perfect place to start your new life. This was my most precious gift of all. And now it's yours. I know you'll honor the family name, my dear. Good luck. Love, Grandpa. P.S. If Louis is still alive, say hi to the old guy for me, will ya? Will do, Grandpa. I can't believe that I call my Grandpa Santa. I mean, he, he does look like Santa, to be fair. You are finally here! Mara, I'm happy to see you again. It has been a couple of months. Has it? Has it, Robin? I can't believe it's it's move-in day for you. Everyone in town is ex uh, excited. You're officially a resident of Stardew Valley. I finished repairing the bridge, restoring electricity to the cottage, restored most of the fences and the other various tasks you assigned me to do. 
Let's head over to Peanut Farm so I can show you. I also have a surprise as well. Yay! Come look at the backyard. Oh my goodness. Look at the new farm. <gasps> There's a little pet house, dog house. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited about that already, you guys. I love it. I always felt really bad that there wasn't a a shelter for the animals, for the cats, cats and dogs, cats and dogs, in the game before. Louis and I cleaned up the backyard and I constructed a pet house for you. This is our way of welcoming you to the valley, Mara. I'm so excited. Louis in, is inside the cottage preparing some things for you still. Since he's busy, this is a good opportunity for me to show you the repaired bridge. Let's go, Robin. I'm so hyped. Sorry about the branches. We had a windstorm last week. Last time you saw the bridge a couple of months ago, it was partially collapsed. I did my best to repair it. It wasn't that easy. I repaired wooden bridges before, but not stone ones. Oh my gosh, I can't wait to see the whole town map now, you guys. I'm so excited. So with the bridge, fence, and uh, shipping bin repairs, restoring electricity and water to the cottage, overhauling the cottage interior, renovating the fireplace and land survey. Hmm. Yeah, give me the bill, lady. The grand total, of course, will be 103,500 gold. Yeah. I have buttons. I have less than buttons right now. I have a pink onesie. She's not getting that. Okay, let's see options. I will only have 500 gold left. I have just enough. I don't have the money for the greenhouse repairs now. Let's go with that. Sorry it was so expensive, Mara. The bridge repairs alone came up to 45k. The stone sl slabs I purchased and equipment I rented wasn't cheap. I get that, lady. I get that. Louis should be finishing, uh, finishing up around now. We should head back to the cottage. I'll go get Louis. He's inside. Let's see if Louis has changed at all with my dad. So we have a massive home farm now. It's even bigger the map than in vanilla. Oh, you are here. He still looks exactly the same. I mean, I didn't really expect him to look any different, but anyways. It has been some time since we last saw each other, Mara. I hope the improvements we've made to Penguin Farm and your Krampus Cottage will make it easier to get settled in. Your furniture and belongings arrived a couple of days ago. Everything is inside. Robin, did you show Mara the improvements out here? She did! I did. Mara is happy with the work uh, that's been done. I am. Yes, thank you so much. That's good to hear. I love the music. All these years is enough time for Farmland to turn into this. You'll need various tools to get started. Clean the local blacksmith made tools to help you get started on cleaning, um, clearing away debris and trees. Oh my goodness! Wait, it has been a little while since I played. You get these either way, but I really like the fact that little little details that she's giving a little, you know, further information, further um, description of where they came from and all that stuff. There's an axe, pickaxe, hoe, scythe, and watering can in your cottage. I'm excited. It'll be a lot of work turning Penguin Farm into what it once was, Mara. Your grandpa would be proud of you. Oh, Grandpa Santa. Tomorrow you should introduce yourself to the villagers. Everyone in the valley knows you just moved in. Demetrius, my husband is excited to meet you, Mara. Drop by your house in the mountains when you have the chance. Will do. The other farmers are thrilled to have another cultiva uh, cultivator in the valley. You should stop by their farms when you get a chance as well. Oh my goodness. So there should be a whole ton of new NPCs added by the mods, you guys. I'm so excited. 
we're going to leave so you can get settled in. If you have any questions or concerns, you know where to find us. Maybe I do. If you get cold, you can use the fireplace. It works great now. I will see you tomorrow. Get settled in. I'm so excited! <laughs> Let's go! I still love these sort of cottage, you guys. So nostalgic. 15 parsnip seeds. Here's a little sun to get you started, Maya Lewis. Thank you. Let's get those. We've met two already cultivated and harvest parsnips. The usual stuff. Let's go and check weather reports. Forecast for tomorrow. It's going to be a clear and sunny all day. Fantastic. Fortune teller. Spirits are very happy today. They will do their best to shower everyone with good fortune. Awesome. Living off the land. Wow, this map is bigger than I thought. Let's check it out. Oh, actually, I think um, the entrance to the other area is still here. But that looks like that's still going to be um, like in our farm area. Right here. Oh, this is so cool. Really loving this area. Oh my goodness, look at this. All the trees. There's so much space in here. They really weren't kidding. It's a massive farm. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness! There's even more space. Oh my gosh. There's so much work to be done here, you guys. So I'm excited. Also, I'm getting stuck. As you do, usually. You know. As you do. Oh my gosh, I love the river here. Look at that. This map is gigantic. Okay, that's fantastic. Let me check this out. You guys, oh my gosh. Okay, just for funsies, let's put it here, because we can. That wasn't a thing in vanilla game. Here we go. I actually, I really like that. Oh my goodness. Yeah, for definitely uh, for someone like me who has been just playing vanilla this whole time, any kind of, any kind of new features are super exciting. And also very confusing, but you know. I'm more uh, excited than confused, so that's good, I think. Okay, here we go. So, first parsnips on the way. Here we go. Let me see. kind of want to get a chest going. That's usually what I do. So I can get rid of um, put all the extra tools away, that sort of things. So before I'm completely out of energy already. Let's do that. 50 wood. Here we go, so let's keep the scythe, and I think we should be okay, actually, let's keep those, so if I see any any sprouts or wormies, like I like to call them. Uh, so let's, let's go and check out town. I'm really excited. Here we go. Oh, look at that, there's a road going there too. I missed that earlier. That's probably where the bridge is. Oh yeah, look at this. So hyped to you guys. <laughs> this is going to be so exciting. Can't wait to see all the new villagers. And all the stuff. Uh, here we go. Minecart is still there. Like like usual. Oh, there's some wormies. Give me those wormies. Yep. First couple ore. Oh, there's Harvey. It's a pleasure to meet you. I'm Harvey, the local doctor. I don't know about you guys, but for me, <laughs> he has always uh, felt like the most boring NPC villager in the entire town. <laughs> it's just, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, Harvey. I kind of like you at the same time. You're kind of boring. Oh, there's Alex. Hello, hello. Wow. Don't hide from me. Oh, the granny, Evelyn, I love her. Well, hello and welcome to a little community, dear. You can call me granny if you like. Um, sure, maybe at some point. Abigail, here we go. That's right, I heard someone new was moving into old old farm. Yes. Kind of a shame, really. I always enjoyed exploring those over overgrown fields by myself. Wow, they're mine now. Can't explore those without my permission. Oh my goodness, you guys. <gasps> You can see the puppy. Can you pet the puppy? Dusty. Oh my gosh. Look how happy he looks. 
Oh, I'm dead, you guys. He looks so happy. You give Dusty many pits. Many, many pits. Oh, the pits for Dusty. That's adorable. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's in a beauty chair. Who are you, sir? Andy. Joja. Oh, he works for Joja. What do you look at that? It's the new farmer everyone has been talking about. Finally moved to the valley, I see. I've been working a fair haven farm here for many years. It ain't much, but it's honest work. I like the name. Fair haven. You're lucky you got that free property from your grandpa. Wow, I saw that side eye expression of his. Totally saw that. Let me see. Yeah, it looks like um at the center town. Looks like everything is pretty much like it was. There's some there's some really nice additions. Little park benches. Oh well, picnic benches, I guess. Oh, you aren't exactly how I imagined, but that's okay. I'm Jody. Yeah, the first uh, <laughs> meeting with Jody, she can be a little odd. <laughs> it's a quiet little town, so it's very exciting when someone new moves in. Have you met the other farmers in our community? That's Caroline. Hello, yes, yes, yes. Oh, she's new. Olivia. Olivia with the pearls. Oh my, aren't you a kitty? Welcome to the valley, dear. It's so exciting when someone new moves in. Have you met my son, Victor? I haven't yet, but I will do. I will do that. Oh, here we go. That's Maru. Are you the, uh, aren't you the new one who just moved in? I'm Maru. I've been looking forward to meeting you. Hi. She's cool. She's cool. She likes science. Oh, I think these are new here, too. The garden in the back here? Really liking that. Oh my gosh, there's a little farm here! Oh, I bet you can go and loot these, you guys. I'm so excited. Honey harvested here is used in the variety of dishes, dishes served at town festivals. Oh, really want to know if I can loot that, too. Or, or if it's, you know, like I said, for just for town stuff. And I need to go and check that out too. Oh my gosh. So anyways, we have 500 gold. As usual. I'm trying to figure out what to do with that money. I think usually I just go and... um. Oh, actually, let's just go and talk to him. I just use that to buy some food. Maybe salad. Something like that. A couple of bread. Um, mm, hi, I'm Clint. Hi. I'm Tom Blacksmith. Yes, yes, yes. I'll come visit if I need any any of your services, sir. Yes, thank you. All right, what's here? Oh, this has definitely been changed. I really like that area. Look at that nice little pond. Park benches. Oh, it used to be clo all closed in with the fences. Really liking that, you guys. There were some secrets in there, though, so... I'm excited. Choja. Yeah, let's go and check Choja. Anything else? Oh, there's the... That's the most pleasant person NPC in the entire town. Uh, Shane's working. He's ignoring me. As he does. Yeah, it looks like Choja is pretty much the same as, as it has been. Oh, hi. I don't know you. Why are you talking to me? Because I'm weird like that. Oh, who is that? Oh my goodness. Is that Victor? Oh, look at him! He's a cutie! Oh, hey there! You're the new owner of Penguin Farm. I'm Victor. It's a pleasure to meet you. Where is it? He's adorable! Okay, definitely keep my eye on him. Here we go. Anything else? Oh my gosh, look at this house. It's a mansion. This is Victor's place. It has to be... Oh my gosh, it's a castle, you guys. <laughs> look at the library! That's... That's amazing. I want to live here. Yeah, so that's probably Victor's um, homestead. Morris's birthday. Oh my gosh. Okay, let me know in the comments below if you guys actually give presents to Morris. I need to. I need to know this. So this um, Andy's birthday this month, as well as Olivia, and some of the some of the villagers that we know and love already. It looks like the shop is pretty much the same. Oh my gosh. It's too late. 6.30. Oh no. Oh no. Abigail is playing video games. 
Oh, we missed Pierre. Dang it. I want to buy some more seeds. <laughs> I'm so excited, you guys. Oh my gosh, look at this. Blue Moon by, by Vineyard? What? Please tell me that I can loot those. <laughs> Here we go, first thing for the museum. Okay, here we go. This is Gunther. First book. Is that the only one? Saddle Oyster. Yeah, I, we need to get this going, guys. So that's probably the same as in Vanilla Game as well. 300 word. Get that going. Nice and just prettified, expanded little fountain area. There's a playground. Cakes. Uh, residents here in Pelican Town use these cakes and barrels to turn their produce into wine and jelly. Something I like to do is to get the campfires going pretty fast here as well. Let's see, 10 wood, 10 stone and fiber. That's the earliest um, you know, outdoor lighting that I like to use. I'm really liking this, you guys. I love lo love the layout, love the uh, stone pathways that they used here already. Here we go. Let's just plop it right here. And I'm passing out. Fantastic. As you do. Snagging those two. Probably don't have enough energy to get enough stone for, for another lamp. Here we go. Day one of spring, year one has been done, you guys. 240 gold from the first day. And like I said, I keep repeating myself. I'm so excited to be playing Stardew Valley modded, you guys. Again, check out the mod list in the description. I'll make sure to keep that updated for you guys so you can you can see where we are going. And again, if you have ideas which which kind of mods you want to see me play with it, definitely let me know in the comments and if you enjoyed the video if you enjoyed the penguin penguin crew here make sure to hit that like sub to the channel come join our live streams i stream several times a week here on youtube and also if you really love the video enjoy the channel consider hitting that heart button below the, below the video to give a small gift that really helps the channel a lot so thank you so much for joining you guys i'll see you in the next video